There it is. Ooh, grill. Wrong. Uh, collect rewards. That's it. Nice. 30 street cred. Not bad. Not bad. Awesome. Right. What's next then? Um, let's go through our inventory and clear off some of the crap. Ooh. An epic. Wait, is Fenya an epic or a legend? Is she? Overture. Rare iconic. Your rare iconic, whereas that's just an epic. Oh, here's smart. Which is better, rare iconic or epic? I'm thinking I'll keep the iconic and I'll break down the epic. It might be a stupid idea, but eh, possible. We got a DS side wider. Well, that can be broken down. That can be as well. Suck that, suck that, suck that, suck that. My knight. Ah, uh, journal. Inventory. Wait a minute. Database. Weapons. Rare iconic. Rare iconic. Exploration, dialogue options, scanning, combat, stealth, quick hacks, character, item. Crafting and upgrading, no. Fixes, districts, sub-districts. There's a lot of information here I could probably read. Characters, story characters, Mama Wells, Jackie Wells. Search bar would be nice. Rocker boy, techies. Weapon, mill attack. Now. Okay, that is literally just my normal bird. That's just. Inf that's not what I'm looking for. Ooh, stats. Not bad. 16 crit damage. Could do better. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Ooh, wow. Does he care? There's a Mizeshi station looking for a new home. Cool. Close. This is gonna. I'm gonna have to do a lot of money. Get try and get our hands on a lot of money, aren't I? That. Oh, that's the. Have I got enough? No, I've not. Have I? I've only got 15. I've only got about half of it. Um. What next then? Uh, nothing to do there. So we have a choice of organized crime activity or that. We'll go for the organized crime activity. Why not? Do that, and then that's the cat. Yeah, that's the north side car. We can't do so. We could always go down and do that. I think there was a tarot card knocking around. Well, oh, wasn't there? Oh. Um. Oh, there's a tarot card there. Got a few jobs actually around there that I could be cracking on with. That looks like it's the last outlier apart from the stupid Delaman mission, so we'll go there and we can go down and do that, collect the steely steely. Oh yeah, right, and also character, so we'll go with... Ooh, do we do max out tech or intelligence? I don't know. Um... Also, while we're at it, let's finally get that one. Yeah, it's 10% chance of upgrading an item free, or we can go with crafted weapons do 2.5 more damage, or 200% efficiency crafted clothes. Grants 20% chance to craft, uh, craft an extra item for free. Allows you to upgrade lower quality components into higher quality ones. Oh, Gordon Bennett! Um, Right, logically, I can't do that until I'm 16, can I? No. Oh, I need to be 16 to get that as well. We could do that, or we could do that, or that's probably our better option because it unlocks those two. Or that. 10% chance to upgrade an item for free. In, it's nice. It'd be nice. Engineering. What have we got in this one? Okay, we've not really touched engineering, have we? So, play better. Play the angles. Ricochet deals 50% more. Luckily, lickety split. Tech weapons charge time. Uh, that's not. Jackpot enables grenades to deal crit hits. Uber charge. 
Fully charged tech weapons. I don't really use the tech weapons, though. Um, increase... Well, I do use tech weapons, just not the tech function. Maybe I should. Increase crit chance with tech weapons by 3%. Shrapnel. All grenade types. Reduce damage taken from explosives. Ooh. When looting drones, mechs, and robots, there's a 25% chance of looting a weapon mod or attachment. Yeah, okay. That increased damage to drones and mechs and robots. Grenades deal 5% more damage. Allows you to charge tech weapons up to 75% capacity. Lock and load. Increase smart weapon. Reload speed. Tech weapons ignore. Oh, Gordon Bennett. Okay, that's definitely one I'm going to get. Um... Be smart weapon. How am I going to do this? Ah, we got one tech point left. The explosion radius grades are visible. Increased damage to drones and mechs. Deal five percent more damage. Use damage taken from explosives by ten percent. All grenades deal twenty percent additional in the normal effects. Ooh, what have I got in the intelligence side of things? Unlocks the turret shutdown demon, which disables sentry turrets in the network for three minutes. Oh, I've done that one. What are we looking at? Increase the duration of demon effects by 100%. Pilot, uh, completing breach protocol reduces the RAM cost of your net quick hack by one. Number of demons uploaded. Upgrade the mass vulnerability demon, causing enemies in the network to also take 30% damage from quick hacks. Ah, oh, Not got enough for that one yet. Arrgh. What does this one do? Unlocks the big sleek demon which disables all cameras for six minutes. What is that? Uh, automatically highlight nearby access points. Upgrading three or more demons in the same breach protocol shortens quick hack cools uh, cooldowns. Head start. Automatically upload the first demon in the list at the start of breach protocol. Not bad. Uh, unlocks the turret. Aim a demon, which sets the status of every turret in the network to friendly for three minutes. Uploading three or more demons into the same breach protocol increases Cyberdeck RAM recovery rate by three units per 60 seconds in the last five minutes. Ah, that lasts five minutes. Okay, that's locked. What are you? That's a thing. Increase breach time protocol by 40%. Ice pick demon increases all... Uh, reduces all... La 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 la. Ooh, do we want to increase breach time? No, we'll do that one. I can't do that one, I need 11. Okay. Um, well. Uh, ah. We go with 6 so we can unlock more weapons. No, we'll consider those last. We'll... Worry about getting those two to 21st? What do we do? Oh, there's also some... I always do one of these because, let's face it, that works. Allows you to perform a non-lethal area takedown on unaware targets. That's also going to be useful. I wish I've had that a few times. Hidden Dragon? One that I think I can sit on. I don't think I need to worry too much about that. Cutthroat. Throw knives deal 30% more damage. Movement speed after successful takedowns increase. Increased damage from headshots from outside combat by 30%. Oh, these are all so nice. Ah, uh, you know what? In for a penny. Oh, I've not, I need nine in that one. Okay, that's not going to work then. Um... Fourteen. What's that one? Reduces component cost for crafting items by fifteen percent. But when teamed with one of the other ones, crafted weapons deal two point five percent more damage. Twenty percent chance for free though. Ah, allows you to upgrade lower quality components. What's going to help me more in the long run? Not got that many weapon crafting ingredients, so efficiency upgrades, I'm guessing. They're done. And we will increase our intelligence by one. I think increase cyberdeck ram, increase quick hack damage. Yeah, because by the end of it, I want to have really powerful quick hacks. Which means, technically, the next place we should really go is the... Got enough money. 
Yeah, we'll go there. We'll go and buy some more cyberdeck bits and pieces. Where's my car? Hello? Where are you? Ah, oh, you are. Okay. Room, 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 Yeah, we'll go and buy some more cyberdeck bits and pieces and see if we can't improve our tactical ability with the quick hacks. Sorry, my bad. Turning, there we go. I'm guessing this is the place the T-Bug told us about, which is in the center of that little islandy thing. What am I getting? I have no idea. I'm I'm going to go and get some quick... Okay, that's a thing that just happened. I'm going to go and get some quick hacks. And see if I can find anything a bit more offensive than what I've currently got. And then I might do a story mission. No, not a story mission. Not that one. A uh, side mission. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, what in terms of the quick hacks am I going to get? I don't know what. Your internet threw a temper tantrum. Don't worry, mine's been throwing a temper tantrum all day. Anyway, I thought you were unfollowing. All because I don't like pina coladas, I mean. No, I stick to the harder stuff, to be honest. Usually stick to the whiskey. Um... I mean, oh, that's right. It's a, I have to go up top, down to... How do I get up there? Um, memory serves, actually. Last time, I got up there by climbing on these boxes because I couldn't figure my way out up to the top. And you know what? That same tactic has worked out fairly well here. How the hell do I get into the... Oh, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> Third played, M7, third played. Oh! What do you know about T-Bug's death? T-Bug's death? What did you hear? The truth. She got burned. Like anyone who tries to hit Arasaka. They found the body in her pad. Nervous system fried. You know what that feels like? Hmm. Can't say I do. They say it's like a hundred thousand knives stabbing you at once. I can't imagine a worse way to go. Poor girl. I liked her, too. Okay, so T-Bug is definitely dead. Right, fair enough. I thought I was expecting it to turn up later on in the game, but whatever. Um, okay, so what have we got? Rare quick hack components. Well, that'd be brilliant if I knew how to, if I had anything I could use to craft quick hacks. Unfortunately, I don't. Short Circuit already got that. Uh, Sonic Shock already got that. Weapon Glitch. Whistle. Ping. Something like Cognition, but more powerful. Have I actually got any sort of epic legend? Oh, I've got Rur. Okay. Triple Movement. Cyberware Malfunction. Overheat. Overheat. Short Circuit. Sonic Shock. Weapon Glitch. Weapon Glitch. It regenerates RAM in a heartbeat. Oh, bloody hell. 11 RAM and 6 slots. Oof. I wouldn't mind one of them. Unless I've already picked one up by accident. Um, Slow rotor, increase Mantis Blades attack. Oh, never mind. Devastating Berserk. Better, 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 better. Okay, I've not picked one of them up then. They're all uncommon. Damn it. Okay, well... Hebrew brain was deep fried mulch. Yeah, pretty much. Um, right, the question is why do I find ways to craft new cyber, uh, new bits and pieces? Also, let's. Cyberware. There we go. 
Nine apps burn. Well, I've got that. Okay, so I can't increase the damage that does. So that's annoying. Short circuit. What else? We've got overheat. Let's replace... What the hell did I just... Uh, I'm gonna... Oh, crumbs. Right, so we've got cognition over... No, I want uh, ping, isn't it? Do, do, do. So I want overheat, thermal damage, electric damage. Sonic shot can be replaced by ping. Triple movement, cyberware malfunction, short circuit, sonic shock, weapon glitch. Thing is that Defense target reducing their ability to detect enemy sounds, preserve. Da, 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 da. Resets enemies optical, rendering them temporary blind. Weapon glitch. Jam targets weapon rendering temporary unavailable. Causing targets weapons to malfunction, reducing accuracy. Spreads to the nearest enemy within 8 meters. Triple movement. Cripple malfunction. Synapse burn out. Lethal deals moderate damage that scales higher based on how much health the target is missing. Oh. Deals low damage that applies poison to the target, spreads to two targets within an 8 meter radius, effective against closely grouped targets, poison lasts significantly longer. Wish I had something like that, but across multiple people. Um, that spreads to nearest targets within 8 meters. Oh. Disables target cyberware abilities, can disable movement, that's not too bad. Cyberware malfunction is amazing, it short circuits people as they freeze for a bit. Okay, never mind, uh, we we'll can do that with... That, that covers... Short circuit. No, that's electrical damage. Uh, it was cyberware malfunction, wasn't it? Cripple movement, cyberware malfunction, can replace cognition, I suppose? What did I just... Oh, no. Um, ping. Cyber... That can be replaced with cyberware malfunction. Uh, I'll keep... Well, synapse burnout, physical damage, or thermal damage. Hmm... I... You know what? I'll replace that with cognition, because I want to keep the poison, because it at least lowers their spec a bit. And I really need to get myself a better... Lasted cyberware. I think that's as much as I can do at the minute on that one. Cool. Right. I still need to find crafting. Oh, right. Crafting. Crafting cyberware. I, why do I find cyberware at the um, quick hack crafting? Recipes. Last of the shop somewhere. Aren't you getting a new chip anyway? Uh, if I can afford it. Don't know how much a new chip's gonna cost me, actually. Where's the nearest Ripper Dock? Literally there. Okay, well. Actually, that might. Oh, that's gonna be Vic's Clinic. I always keep going, end up back at Vic's Clinic, and I don't always intentionally do that. Oh, cut. Oh, come on, I jumped on it. Boing. Boing. Ah, well. Let's go see Vic and get ourselves an upgrade on our side. Oh no, it might not be Vic. Oh, it isn't Vic, it's, um... Jim Dude. I've not actually bought anything off him yet. Hello. Looking for a change. Come on, then. Time to tinker. I don't have... Nah, I don't have any blueprints. Um... Hands. What can I do with the hands? Let's see, we've got ballistic core processor. Increases the chance to ricochet shots. Smart link allows you to use smart targeting. Oh wait, that's a legendary smart link. Smart link. What was my current? Common. Ooh. Allows you to use smart targeting module on smart weapons, increasing the chance of a smart bullet to hit the targets 15 and create a diff trans. Directly links to the user's optical. Yep, no, we're equipping that. Okay, right. And Dr. Chrome. Um I was doing my cyberware, wasn't I? Can I upgrade my cyberware yet? There's a legendary cyberware that costs more than I actually have. That sucks. 
That's six base RAM, six buffer size, four, four slots. Seven base RAM, six buffer size, four slots. But I don't really need that. So what I'm going to do is... Different Ripper Ducks sell different items, by the way. Ah, well, we'll have to remember Dr. Chrome because he's got a legendary cyber deck for me. What have we got here? Okay, so I need eight body to equip these eight and ten. Increased stamina, don't need to worry about that. Uh, increases health regen outside of combat by 2.74 seconds. Ah! When your health drops below 15%, an electrical charge deals damage, increases breach... Wait, increases breach time of breach protocol by 10? Okay, so... Ah, oh, right. I've got that, but I need 8 body to do it. I think I've only got about 6 at the minute. Do I want to risk it? I might leave that until late game, to be honest, before I go and apply anything like that. What else have we got in here? We have allows you to aim and shoot while dodging. Nope. Blows time by 25% for 2 seconds when you are detected by enemies. Cooldown 60 seconds. Increase evasion by 3%. Well, tempting. I suppose I can always fit something into that slot, can't I? Sure, we'll try that and see what we get. And this is subdermal dermal armor, rur, subdermal armor, common. What else am I supposed to fit into that slot then? When affected by burn, uh, instead of receiving damage from it, you sit, you deal 10% more damage. Oh, not bad. Grounding plate, that's for electricity. Subdermal weave grants immunity to bleeding. Grants immunity to burn. Subdermal armor, already got that equipped. So I can only apply one subdermal armor and then two types of additional types of subdermal armor, I'm guessing, unless there's an extra thing. Oh, that's going to be coating, isn't it? A grounding plate and... Okay, right, I get, I get it now. Um, Legs. Well, I have a couple of... No, actually, I don't have anything available that I can use at the minute, so fine. Skeleton. I do have that. Increase attack speed by 5%. Yeah, sure. I mean, I've got it. I might. We'll use it. Uh, immune system, I've checked that, yeah. And that is literally stuff. Have I got anything better in this one? Increase crit chance by 7%. Increase cyber deck max RAM by 1 unit. Defeating an enemy instantly recovers 1 cyber deck RAM. Increase cyber deck RAM recovery rate by 0 0.5 seconds. Increase crit chance by 7. <laughs> Ooh, what do we do with this one? Do we want to increase our crit chance, or do we want to keep our cyber deck? No, I've got an intelligence build, so we'll keep that for the time being. I think that's everything. I've changed out the smart link. Gorilla arms. Well, I can't afford anything else anyway, so... Uh, Kiroshi. Not got anything new in terms of optics. Oh, yes, I think. Raid? Ooh. Oh, well, that's where I find the crafting. That wasn't bloody obvious in the slightest. Battery, low capacity cyberware mod, increase max charge of chance damage. No, that's fine. Focus berserk. Okay. Nanoplastic plating allows you to craft a cyberware mod. Allows you to craft a cyberware mod. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so I need to go and visit different Ripper Ducks when I've got a bit of money to my name. Awesome. Right, cool. Thank you, Dr. Crow. Map. Right, that's trying to take me to Judy, but we also have that one. Oh, and there's literally a Ripper Dock next door. Okay. Well, I'm going to see the Ripper Dock next door because I want to see what a different Ripper Dock has. Hey, How am I going to get there then? Um... Can you just let me, like... Okay. Goodbye. Didn't need your help in the end anyway, sweetheart. Good. Actually, come to think of it, money is an issue I've had this entire game. I'm doing mission after mission, and yet I still don't seem to generate a lot of cash. Probably because everything I pick up, I get converted into other bits and pieces. Suppose once I start being, I'm able to start creating epic and other 
things. I could probably start selling them for a quick money boost, couldn't I? Just realised, why am I literally running to the Ripper Dock? I could have just got on my in my car or on my bike. Oh well, there we go. That has it. The Ripper Dock. Oh yes, this is. Oh, this is a fancy looking Ripper Dock office. Howdy. Been doing biz here long. Two years, maybe more. Wasn't easy at first, but I made the right connections. Half the heavy lifting in business is the networking. This and the will to be cooperative and flexible. What kind of stuff you got? Okay, have you got any different leg things? No, not really. Uh, no, not really. Blimey. Um, what's that? Ooh, increase all resistances by 8%. Can I fit that? Oh, no, it costs money. Balls. Um, I mean, technically, I'm very tempted to go for it. Blood pump. Activate instantly restores 50% of max health cooldown for 50 seconds. Sign cyber were to quick slot to activate with five. Oh, that's very tempting. Excuse me. That's very, very tempting. Instantly restores 10% of stamina when you defeat an enemy. Instantly restores 30% of health when health drops to 50 percent cooldown is equipped. Uh, oh, six thousand or fifty thousand. Go for six thousand. There we go for six thousand. Okay, what have you got in terms of crafting? Crafting target analysis allows you to craft. Uh, crafting chemical round. Crafting battery medium capacity. Okay. Oh, no new eyes. In terms of the memory boost. Time's kind of tight here. Yeah, what? I'll right. oh, shut up. Increase health by 20%. Synaptic signal optimizer, 40,000. Ooh, do we want more health or do we want health regen? I. It's very tempting to go for health regen. What have we got here? Can't afford either of them. Time's kind of tight here. Oh, shut up. Increase all resistance. Oh, that, right. I've already looked at that one. Yeah, well, I'm going to go for this one. That stings, but... Got some next-level tech on offer. Yeah, well, I do have the city's best suppliers on my side. Anyone I've heard of, I wonder? Oh, <laughs> unlikely. My suppliers like to keep things on the down low. Hang on. Authorization not found. Okay. Thank you for the jacket. Goodbye. Awesome. Right, there we go. <laughs> I'm quite happy with that one. Right, let's see what this one is. Introducing Alois Decan, a deadbeat with a pretentious name. Gonk broke my trust and skipped town. Well, fuck him. Only thing I care about now is the data he left in NC. Specifically, what's on his comp. Check the attachment, you'll see what to do. Okay. Uh, Luis Delquin, the Corpo Mega Prick who, who cheated me. And not only me. There's a whole city out there that wants to get its hands on the guy. As they say, the fate of the traitor is sealed at the time of his betrayal. But what interests me beyond my vengeance is Eloise's data pad. Well, uh, and, well, the data on it. Our traitor picked up and fluffed right, fluffed off right out of NC so fast he left his gear in town. Just 20 minutes ago, I got a login ping from his comp in Elsewire saying do 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 do. Head over there and grab his device. Once we get it, we can have, uh, then uh, we can take advantage of this confused mess. Okay, cool. Do that. Go in, steal a laptop, and probably run into a bunch of tiger goons in the process. Quick save. Just in case. Uh, no, the hound. I don't think I've met the hound yet.
Cool. That was real useful. <laughs> I like this new one. Okay. Him. Down there. Hopefully there's no cameras or anything. Nighty night. Alright, I really wish I'd picked up the stealth thing for actually picking up the body right after doing something, but whatever. Dump. Cool. Right, okay. So that's one. And... Nighty night. Dump him in this crate as well. Cool. What else we've got knocking around here, then? You're eating a burger and it tastes fake. Is it synth meat? Are you... Are you... Oh, crumbs. Are you actually living in Night City right now and I've just not realised it? Is Cyberpunk 2077 real and my street dream lab took me through a portal in time and space? Or are you just eating a really bad burger? All of the above. Possibly. Maybe. Or not. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going with this either. Wibble. No. Goodbye. Find a bridge or something to dump you in. Um, oh, crook. Okay, right. There's a woman asleep on a table. I uh, didn't realise that. <laughs> that was fortunate, wasn't it? Bad train. Uh, yes, yeah, sir. It's a temporal shift. And it's bad train cafe burger. Okay. I don't know that chain, to be honest. I can't knock her out. Okay. Uh, um, well, you keep sleeping there, sweetheart. I'm just going to sneak around here. Oh, crumbs. Um. Oh, there's a thing here. Okay, this mod has definitely made my life a lot easier. Awesome. Right. Uh, what's that? Something. Two data points are upstairs, I'm guessing. Good job I took that chap out of the kitchen, isn't it? Otherwise, they could have gone up to get a soda or something and all of a sudden found their comrade asleep on the floor. I mean, knocked out on the floor. Oop, that's it. Uh, let's close the door. In case I remember Fallout. Uh. Not a chain. I'm currently on a train traveling. Oh! Oh, right. Well, fair enough. That, yes. Okay. Travel food generally doesn't taste nice. Unless you're in Japan, in which case the stuff you get from the convenience stores is bleeding amazing. DD. Five. That works. Next interface. You know that cyberpunk mods are out. Oh, are they? Yeah, but I'm not going to start fiddling around with mods just yet. I, I mean, I'd love to, but... Ooh, I got a legendary quick hat component. Awesome, that's where I'm picking them up. I mean, I made that mistake with Fallout 4 where I basically started playing it and installed a bunch of mods and then it sort of ruined it a bit for me. Not that it helped that the game really didn't play... Uh, really didn't grip me as hard as Fallout New Vegas did. So I'm not going to start playing around with mods just yet. I probably will after we've finished the 100% run, and I might do it to spice the game up a bit. I mean, if they add some companions and more romance options, then by all means. But for the moment, I'll just stick with what I've got now. Um, 